Hello and welcome back to another video. So, today I'll be looking into the evolving mod add-on. Now, I've not done a lot with this. I've added it to a world and uh, uh, seen a couple of the mobs. I've seen like a low level one and a couple of, like a high level zombie, spider and skeleton. I was all skeleton for about five seconds before my armor teleported away when it attacked me. Um, but yeah, and something I can tell you right now is that it can get a bit annoying when I'm just like doing stuff for it, you know, so I am my chest and then suddenly like a level one like zombie just runs up and hits me. Because one, it forces me out of the chest and two, they can open doors. <laughs> So yeah, can get quite annoying. Evolving more bad on. So yeah, evolving mob. So well, that's a very bit crunched version of the thing. Anyway, um, welcome to the evolving go mobs add on. In this add-on you can catch, train and evolve most of the hostile mobs. In this uh, device you will learn about all the different mechanics about mob mobs and items. Interact to go to the next page. Catching. To catch a mob you have to throw your capture orb at them. Then the capture orb will do work for you and uh, capture the uh, mob. Once a mob is captured, the uh, filled orb will drop on the floor. You can pick up the orb. You can pick the orb up and uh, release the mob whenever uh, and wherever you want. Only mobs in the M O B S tab. Mobs tab. Ah, so we need to ca make a capture orb. No, I don't know. Oh, cat. Yeah, here you go. Capture orb. Looks a bit weird. Oh, apparently, oh, apparently there's also XP orbs. Uh, so, oh, it's quite cheap. You get, oh, 16 for 3 gold and 2, uh, 2 gold and 3 iron. That's pretty good. 3 iron. Oh, there was one in my, there. There's another one there. There's your spider one. 1, 2, 3. One, two, and you make sixteen capture orbs. Aww. Mob orb. Once you've captured a mob with a capture orb, they will be held inside a mob orb. There's a few important things to know about the mob orb. While inside a mob orb, the mob will fully heal, however, they will also lose their current XP level and get hungry. They do always keep their level. So they keep their level, but they like lose XP. That's a bit confusing. Oh, come on. Go away. Yeah, you can see what I mean about them. Uh, just like spawning and like opening doors and being a pain in the butt. Hi. Is this even? Yep. There we go. Hopefully that'll stop him. Hold on. Kill at E type equals which. There we go. She was annoying me. When in a mob orb, mobs get hungry. See icon. This means that uh, when you release them again, they won't be able to initially get back into action. You can feed them any kind of food, they will be ready and they'll be ready to go. Note, the player who feeds the mob automatically becomes their owner. Huh. A key. Leveling. When you've uh, captured a mob, you uh, can start leveling them up. You uh, can do this by letting them fight all the mobs. Level uh, them up enough and they will evolve into strong a stronger form. 
If a mob has reached its uh, final form, you can train them up to level 100. Some of uh, the uh, mobs uh, that mobs will evolve, but one and uh, some twice. The level at which they evolve is different for each mob. You can see all the uh, specific specifics in the uh, mob section of this uh, device. Okay, uh, when you've uh, caught a mob instead of uh, the uh, spawning when they die, they will get KO'd. Once they uh, go on KO, you will either have to uh, restore their health with one of the healing items, or you can recapture them in the, their mob orb. You uh, will uh, recognize KO by the uh, particles and stance of the mob. See. Items. Items uh, are crafted with their own recipes, which you can find in the items menu. Other way to obtain them is to uh, keep your mobs out of their mob orb. Sometimes they, while they're walking around, they might randomly dig up an item. The stronger the item, the lower the odds they will find it. So we have like creep level one. So this is level one creeper, creepers. Creepers attack by uh, releasing a small burst of energy around its enemies, which forms a small explosion, evolves into creeper. Uh, so that's creepy, evolves into creeper. The creeper is a vanilla variant in the, in the evolved uh, chat. They attack by forming a stronger explosion near their enemy. Evolves from creepy, evolves into creeper or or. or. This is the creeper or whatever. The creeper attacks his enemy as a combining the power of 100 creepers through mind control. He evolves from creeper. But then we have blaze. The blaze is a vanilla variant in the C evolution chart. It attacks his enemies by firing a burst of three small fireballs. Evolving evolves into king blaze. And all of these can spawn naturally, so far I know. Um. King Blaze attacks their enemies by uh, charging up longer and collecting enough power for a uh, burst of 9 shots. He rolls into Emperor. So this is like the Blaze Emperor. Uh, Emperors are much stronger than their previous evolutions. They uh, can uh, collect the collect and uh, shoot enormous energy balls in a very short in a very short period of time. And you have Enderman, Enderman of an They teleport behind their enemy to attack them from behind. He rolls into Endor Ethereum. Endor Ethereum are immensely powerful evolutions and they use the force of the end to suck their enemy into their deadly grip. And you have Gasty. Gasty is a small mob that fires a single fireball. They do have their agility and the speed on their side evolves into Gast. You know about Gast, and then there's Gast Gastodon. That's very close to Gastrodon from Pokemon. Gastodons have their entire insides made out of lava. When angry, they spit out the heat that's built up in built up at their enemies. Then you have skeletons. Ske Skelly 4. Skeleton, skelly 4s have a very agile, a fast skeleton evolution, and all the four of their arms pack a punch. And you have Spiddy, which we saw earlier. Spiddies are the baby evolution of spiders. They are very fast, but not very strong, but they are adorable. Yeah, they are cute. Then you have spiders, and then you have the spider docks. So the Pithodoxes have mastered the powers of the webs. They uh, can engulf enemies in their area with a very uh, strong uh, behind web and uh, to slow their enemies down while hitting them constantly. Oh, then you have the Vex. The Vex is a small, but I don't know, yeah, we know about Vex, they vanilla. They evolve, evolve into Vexor. A Vexor is a uh, supercharged Vex so that it launches a powerful electric force at its enemies. It's so strong it explodes into big thunderbolts. Then you have the Warden, we know about the Warden. And then it evolves into War Skulk. War Skulk smashes into the ground hard enough to make the uh, deep dark shake. 
Yes, that's like twice as powerful as a warden, apparently. Then you have like wither skeletons that evolve into scalyord. Scalyord is the uh, slow evolution of the wither skeleton, but you, uh, if you get hit, you get to hit hard. Then you have wivy. Wivy attacks by shooting a uh, small wither skull. They're faster, but rather clumsy. Not so witty, I guess. Evolves into the wither. Which evolves into wyvern. Wyverns consume the souls from the soul sand to a latch a stronger energy, launch stronger, stronger energy balls at their enemies. And this in combination with their ag agility makes them very tough opponents. And you have Gnawi, the baby zombies basically. Then you have zombie, and you have chomp, 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 champ, chomp, champ. Don't know why that was so hard for me to read. It's a uh, collection of all of the uh, targets from its previous form. It uh, can uh, stomp the ground so hard, big rocks may uh, might shift. Then you have slimes, which evolve into glo globule. Is a collection of slimes that have formed into a stronger toxic blob. Stories have said that uh, one inhale of its gas could KO an ender dragon. Reminder on my phone. They have the pickle and brute, which evolves into Baconator. Is a uh, is the only mob strong enough to carry around his hammer. And uh, do they uh, know how to use them too? Who gave them the hammer? Who gave them the hammers? And you have the healing berries, which is a sweet berry and four sugar. Now, I don't have any sweet berries, I don't think. Oh, wait, no, I do. Yeah, so sweet berries. And uh, where's the sugar cane? I should have a chest somewhere. The sugar cane. Where's the sugar cane chest? I'm pretty sure I have a sugar chest. Is it over here? It might be over here. Where's my sugar cane? Oh, it is right there. One, two, three, four. Just craft these up into that. So you have healing berries. Oh, you get four pair. Yeah, it's more than I thought you get. Oh, right, yeah, so say four pair. Uh, strength. So, oh, stop, hold on. Healing berries. Heal berries, heal them all, but with a small portion of their health. Cures hunger and KO. Strength berries give the mobs an extra attack boost, cures hunger, you get four pair, that's apple and four iron ingots. I need it. And strength berries. And you've got resistance berries. Yeah, so this is just give them resistance. That's a cactus. Why cactus? I don't know. Golden nugget and the uh, an amethyst. I'm going to craft all these. So two cat seed berries, two cactus and three nuggets. Again, why cactus? And you have healing device. Uh, healing device fully heals the mob back to max health. Cures hunger and KO, which is a healing berry and four iron. Healing device. Uh, 
Then you got attack buff device, which is just that, and gold, yeah, same. Well, just like that. There you go. Wait, what was that one? Uh, defense buff device, yeah. Level up candy, levels up the... Uh, increases mob level by one, that's iron, two paper and two XP cannon. You didn't tell us about XP candy yet. Uh, orbs, yeah, so XP orbs, four paper, and an emerald. So, if I get a stack of that, uh, an emerald, XP orbs. Oh. Let me get a bit more. Uh, this. Boom. Boom. How about you get a lot of these? Yeah, four pair. And I'm probably going to want a lot because uh, probably just going to like show off there all like the mobs evolving and all that. Uh, and there's another stack. There we go. And then I need iron ingots. So two stacks of iron. Boom. I need to... I need more paper. Oh, I more paper. One, two, three. Here we go. Paper. Level up, can you? Here we go. I'm gonna need more than that, but this will do for now at least. And I can just cheat some more in there. You go. Yes, yeah, so I got capture orbs, and that's everything. Okay. So yeah, let's uh, see if we can find a creepy. There'll probably be one down here. Yeah. Okay. Well. Uh, let's just hit these guys. What one is? I said, I just like, yeah. Let's see. Oh. Got two zombies, a spider. Didn't get a creeper, but that well because it was too close probably, and I didn't get a creeper one. Oh, hello you, come back here, come back here you. Come yeah, on, I just want to stab you a little bit. Just gonna stab you up a little bit. Come on. Come here. It's really hard to hit you. There we go. Oh! Don't tell me that's gonna bug it out and give me the zombie now. Okay, it didn't. It just goes to like the first one that got sucked in, I guess. Oh no, that's creepy. Yeah, creepy zombie. So yeah. And I got a spider as well. Um. Uh, uh, so I could do with a skeleton, but they don't have, that doesn't have a baby form, so I'd have to find a normal skeleton somewhere. Oh, well, there's a big skeleton there. I'm not 
looking for the big skeletons. Yeah, I'll get around to the skeleton when it's uh, time. Teleport. Um. Here we go. And I need to eat. If it will let me. There we go. Don't know why it's so laggy. Um. Yeah. Close up. Oh! Yeah, and another thing is that they can spawn pretty much wherever. They don't care about light levels by the looks of it. Uh, oh, yeah, there we go, you're dead. It's not your turn yet. Oh, actually. Um. So let me see. So, creepy. We have the creepy, so. There we go. Nothing. Oh, there's, there's guys down there. I'm going to go fight them. So if I give you some, like, level up candy. Get two, three, four, five. Hold on. Let's get you back in. Can I just... Wait, click and you'll go back in. Yep. There we go. Let's take him up away from any hostile mobs. There we go. We can get a better look. Oh! It's him back to level 1 and I don't know why. Also, yeah, it reset everything. I don't know why. Don't have a... Yeah, so when I placed him down, it didn't give me a creepy ball or anything, so I don't know. Yeah, it's odd. He doesn't seem to give you the ball back. Oh, he's trying to tag something down there. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Oh, there we go. About 24, it evolves into... A creeper! And for some reason, he's really low on health. 27, hold on. Wait, is he no longer tamed again? No, he is tamed. Confused for a second there, because I thought... Oh! Why don't you attack the spider? No, he's not interested. Yeah, he's just interested in something on the floor. 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 50. God damn it. 54, 55. There we go, 55 E evolves. God damn, these little guys are annoying. Uh, he's a big creeper. Is he going to attack something? No. Come on, protect me! Look, there's a little guy there you can attack. Like, nah. Not interested. That's that, but how do I, like... Shift, right, I'm, like, right clicking. You're gonna do something. Uh, yeah, that was sweet. Uh, Just die. There we go. Yeah, it's a bit not very functional. Now, if I get him in his ball, in a ball, is he still going to be level 55 when I lay him back out? Oh. 
He didn't even go in to the ball this time. I don't know, this cell does a bit buggy. And he could just be the will diamond, because this will does have a few problems, but seems a bit broken. Uh, what I'll have to do is I'll have to go into a separate will and uh, test if it's like if these problems still persist. And if they do, then you're probably not going to see that, but if they don't, I'll be like, hey, they're not persistent. Oh, this is the slime. He also is not following me. It's a bit odd. Uh, well, so, yeah, uh, like, my main problem right now is that they can spawn and will spawn literally anywhere. And it is annoying, because you can have an entirely lit up base where no hostile mobs can spawn, but these guys will still spawn. Again, and again, they can open up doors. Uh, they can open up doors, which is annoying. Yeah. Can I just eat, please? Thank you. You need creeper, creeper. See, so yeah, blaze. Oh, I'm gonna take this with me. So if I some blaz, so can I just chuck one of these in? No. They didn't really say how you catch a normal. Minecraft mobs. Uh, if I stab him, he's just gonna die. Oh, wait, I did catch the blaze. Yeah, I got one blaze. Weird. So we release the blaze, feed him, tame him. So he evolves twice and he's just blown away. Yeah, uh, they're not acting like a dog or anything, they're just, or a cat, they just, <coughs> they're just flying away. Which is annoying, get back here, I need to level you up so I can uh. Oh, now he's invisible. Oh, now he's over there. Oh, stand still. Two. Get back. Three, four. Five. Come here. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Come on, stop flying away. Where are you even going? You're just flying randomly. Oh, at level seventeen, he evolves. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 33, 34, 35, 36, 30. Oh, 56 evolves again. Yeah, you do look cool. Just pain in the... 
Hey, there's a guy down here. You want to attack him? No? How are you supposed to level them up without just like spamming these uh, level up pick handy? Is uh, if they don't attack anything? You away! Alright, yeah. Yeah, right. yeah, this ain't very useful. Anyway, Enderman's next. You're going to be annoying because you're going to be teleporting around. Come here. Oh, I missed. Drop. Where'd he go? No idea. Try some of them in here. Maybe he'll be a bit more cooperative. Do that. Oh, that's a nice frame. Uh, Don't even know where that went. I just hit myself. Okay, just not gonna. I can't just put it down and. Yeah, damn it! Teleporting away, yeah. Uh. Oh, right, I got an Enderman, I think. Yeah, Enderman. There we go. Oh, that was annoying, but I got him. You're trying to hit an enemy with a projectile, that's not gonna work. Also, where did that where did the creeper one go? Just wandered off and disappeared. Alright, so I put the enderman down, I feed entertainment. Son of a bitch, get back here. Alright. This is gonna. Six. No! Mm. God damn it! Where'd he go? Oh, this is a pain in my butt. Where'd he go? There he is. Was that the one of the random and the no. Oh, come on! No. Where? Where did he go? Well, I'm not going to be able to share the Enderman one because they won't stop teleporting away. I think I can. Uh, and yeah, yeah, let go. 
Can't move. Take damage. Come on. There we go. Ah, it's Bob. Bob! He died. He died. Oh, grab my tower and egg. Can you grab me and it's Bob? Can I get out of this? Hello? I can't. Hello? I can't move. Oh. Hold on, let's try saving and quitting. And going back in. Yeah, god damn it. Oh, there's a level 13 enemy that I saw in the area. Okay, let's try this again. Stab, step. Don't pick me up. Ah, oh, he's knocked out. And these have stopped working. Too bad them and just and cooperative. I right, do, do you want to co? No, he's already teleported away, and he's running away. His hands a bit bad. Then we got the gas to you. I'm not. I'm just gonna summon one in. Some gas. How do you spell it? G H A S. So you'll find these right around in the never. They are kind of huge. He's just dark. get back here. Uh. Oh, they're small and agile. Well, the ways are a pain in the butt to hit. Just, god oh, damn it! Stop being a pain and get down here. If only I had a uh, ally that could fly and attack him. Oh, we found an item. That's cute. Oh, I'm all out. I'm all out. Wow. Ew. At P. Instant. God damn it. Word one. Where are you? Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is annoying. Oh, I'm in creative. In... Boom. There we go. Alright, so we have the Ghastly Mob. 
There you go, I ate the golden cow. Don't fly away! I need to feed you! Come back here! Two. Three. And he's gone. Okay, yeah. No, I just can't be bothered. Maybe if I go and create it, it might be... Oh, wait, he's back. Uh, there's not... Uh, I'm struggling to really find a point to like, just continue on with this. I don't know, because it's just not working. Like, yeah, sure, he looks cool, but what's the point of them looking cool if this add-on just does not work? Like, it's a really cool idea, and I, was, and I got excited when I saw, oh, this could be fun and cool, and the, the, uh, maybe there's like, uh, be like a, like, some more like Pokemon inspired, uh, like kind of add on, but it's just like, it just does not work properly. Like, I, I you know, I could continue on with, the, with this add on view and just like, oh, look at how we're in the guys, and the blah, 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 blah. But ultimately, if, you know, if it, if they just don't work, why 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 should I just why should I continue on doing the review of this? Because yeah, I pretty much can say no. Don't don't buy this. Not worth your money. All right, we can see if it's just like that will because that will has had problems with like stable mod add-ons before. With like uh, if you go back and watch my Tinker's Construct review, uh, that was really buggy. Like that was. Barely functioning buggy, but I have been unable to recreate that level of bugginess for Tinker's Construct in any other world, and it's just that world. So uh, I do have this other world, which it, which I can use to test it out in, to see if it is just that world being buggy, or if this island just does not work. But honestly. Most add-ons, it's not too bad, so I find it hard to believe. Oh, it would help if I activated the add-on. Uh, behavior packs, active, deactivate essentials. And we want to activate evolving mobs. Alright, capture orbs, and I'm just gonna summon. So, I'm just gonna summon like the zombie one. And, um, what is. Hold on. Oh, like the whip one. Let's have a look at the whip one. The whip one might be. Uh, bear, there's creeper, blaze, enderman. Or then. Uh, whiffy. Uh, come back, come, yeah, get back here. Oh, there we go. So I got a wivy. So, uh, I have carrots on me. And he instantly flies away. So it's not just my world being weird, it's just, it's just not functioning. So if I, let's say I summon another Wivy real quick. Will my Wivy fight the other Wivy? Nope. Hold on. Well, if I'm in also that was a copy. And ah, now I'm on fire. What's taking damage? Oh, I'm on fire. Why am I on fire? 
Okay. Well, useless. Yeah, add on just does not work. I I I I all. So yeah, uh, I cannot recommend this light at all because it one it's annoying because they spawn literally everywhere and they will attack you and disturb you when you're crafting or just going through your chest and they can open doors. They don't even work properly because they don't follow you about when you tame them. They don't attack mobs that are attacking you. So how are you supposed to level them up without crafting a bunch of the uh, level up candies? And they're just, it's, they're just genuine, and they don't follow you about, like, why, why, why release us in a literally non-functional state? Like, come on. So, yeah. Uh, avoid this at all costs. Don't bother wasting your time with this rubbish, rubbish add-on. Like, seriously, it is just not good at all. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this, enjoyed my uh, frustration and suffering. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.